Hey, what's up coin hunters and welcome to a quick look through £100 in £2 coins. So without wasting any more seconds, it's going to be a super quick video. We are going to look through and see if we can finally get that English Commonwealth Games coin. We have found Wales, we have found Scotland, we have found Northern Ireland, we have never found an England. Hopefully, today's going to be different. So here we go. So, oh, we've got to find straight away. There we have the Brunel. Very cool. I've seen these listed on eBay as the Abraham Lincoln coin. Which was quite funny. We've got another one to find here. And if I can get it the right way around, there we go. It's a Florence Nightingale. So that's not bad. So hopefully, we will be in luck and get an England Commonwealth Games. I'm going to keep going on about it until I finally find it. And that could be forever. So nothing in this bag yet. No, nope, nothing in that bag. So let me just put that there. All right, my bank is still not accepting two pound coins. That's why I'm neatly lining them up there um, in the machines. For the last few months, um, for some reason, someone there's been an influx of fakes. So keep an eye out on your two pound coins. There's a Trinity House. So yeah, there's been an influx of fake £2 coins um, coming into the UK and what people have been doing um, is trying to put them into change machines and obviously they're being expelled, um, like rejected and so they've just been bagging them up and paying them into my bank, well not just my, not my branch but the actual bank itself, there's um, World, First World War, shoulder to shoulder, the last commemorative to come out. So yeah, so for the past few months I've had to bag them up and take them to a different bank. Um, I did take them in because I didn't want to pay them in to the bank I got them from. I went to a different branch in Central London. And literally, I was in there for an hour while the lady looked at it and then she turned it and then she put it down and she looked at it and she come across like one like this and was like, I've never seen this, is it real? And things like that. So there's a Charles Darwin there. So it was, took ages. And then I explained to her what she really needs to look out for with the fakes because you can always look at it and you see where the little um, hologram is in the middle. 99% of the fakes don't have it. Right, so that's all our bags. That was quick, isn't it? We've got two, four, five finds out of this £100. So what do we get? We got the Brunel. One of my favourite £2 coins, the Florence Nightingale. My actual favourite one is the Great Fire of London. There's Trinity House. There is a World War One. And we got Charles Darwin. So really cool few finds. But nothing too too rare. So guys, thank you very, very much for watching this video. If you've enjoyed it and you haven't already hit that subscribe button somewhere down there and become a member of the UK Coin Hunter family. So guys again thank you very very much and I'll see you in the next one. Take care and happy coin hunting. Goodbye.